The Monster Who Lost His Mean by Tiffany Strelitz Haver, illustrated by Kirsty Edmonds, read by Grandpa Tom. Monsters are a spooky bunch, a scary, hairy group. They run in packs, leave giant tracks, and dine on eyeball soup. M is for mean. O is for observant. N is for noisy. S is for super strong. And T, tough to please. E, envious. R, remarkable. A monster's all of these. One day a monster's M went missing. Gone without a trace. So now he's just the onster, and the teasing never ends. Not only has he lost his mean, he's lost his monster friends. Boom, boom, crunch, crunch. The onster sits alone for lunch. Boo hoo, sigh, sigh. The onster's sad and starts to cry. I'm nothing since I lost my mean, he sobs into his stew. I've got to find that M or else. It's bye-bye monster crew. The onster tears through all his sheets and peeks beneath his bed, explores around the playground, and picks apart his shed. He empties every garbage can and all of monster wood, he even checks the engine under every monster's hood. Nothing. Not a... Not a trace. He hangs his hairy head. Without my am, I'm not myself. I'm someone else instead. He can't be mean to human kids. So why not help with chores? Sweeping, heaping, lighthouse keeping. Organizing drawers. He joins in all their soccer games and rules at basketball. He doesn't seem to miss that missing M so much at all. I'm having tons of fun, he laughs, returning from a swim. And then he hears some other monsters making fun of him. The monster feels embarrassed. He sees their point of view. I really need to stop this stuff. And do what monsters do. Maybe I'll pretend I'm mean. I bet it's not that hard. Perhaps I'll pull the flowers out of Mrs. Power's yard. He stares at all the roses in their stunning shade of red, but just can't bear to harm them, so he waters them instead. The onster thinks, I'll throw some eggs at Mr. Lander's van but winds up cooking brunch for the entire Lander clan. I'm way too nice without my M. My monster days are through. I just don't fit in monster wood. I'm not sure what to do. He sadly heads on home again with teardrops in his eyes. He swings his front door open and is greeted with... Surprise! A party in his honor, the monster's eyes grow wide. His name and picture cover every empty space inside. I'm not a monster after all, the monster comprehends. I may have lost my M, but then I've found amazing friends. Boom, boom, pow, pow. The monster waves and takes a bow. Let's have three cheers. Hip, hip, hooray! He's happier in every way. The End